Corinthium, Sheni, 2 Corinthians 6. We then, as workers together with him, beseech you also that ye receive not the grace of Yahuwah in vain. For he says, I have heard you in a time accepted, and in the day of Yeshua have I helped you. Behold, now is the accepted time. Behold, now is the day of Yeshua. Giving no offense in anything, that the ministry be not blamed. But in all things, approving ourselves as the ministers of Yahweh, in much patience, in afflictions, in necessities, in distresses, in stripes, in imprisonments, in tumults, in labors, in watchings, in fastings, by pureness, by knowledge, by long suffering, by kindness, by the Ruach HaKadesh, by love unfeigned, by the word of truth, by the power of Yah, by the armor of righteousness, on the right hand and on the left, by honor and dishonor, by evil report and good report, as deceivers and yet true, as unknown and yet well known, as dying and behold, we live as chastened and not killed, as sorrowful yet always rejoicing, as poor yet making many rich, as having nothing and yet possessing all things. O ye Koratim, our mouth is open unto you, our heart is enlarged. Ye are not straitened in us, but ye are straitened in your own heart. Now for a recompense in the same, I speak as unto my children. Be ye also enlarged. Be ye not unequally yoked together with unbelievers. For what fellowship has righteousness with unrighteousness? And what communion has light with darkness? And what con concord has Yahushi, rather, Yahusha HaMashiach with Bela'el, rather, bel i ya -al. Or what part has he that believes with an infidel? And what agreement has the temple of Yahweh with idols? For ye are the temple of the living Yah. As Yahweh has said, I will dwell in them and walk in them, and I will be their Elohim, and they shall be my people. Wherefore, come out from among them, and be ye separate, says Yahweh, and touch not the unclean thing, and I will receive you, and will be a father unto you, and ye shall be my sons and daughters, says Yahweh, Sevaoth.